Hi, everybody. Um, I'm taking this time. I'm actually just leaving the barn. Um, I was feeling kind of sad. And I've been working hard to build uh, this this wonderful business that I enjoy doing. But um, I took time away from my other love and passion um, and it is being at the barn and working with the horses and working with my horse rooster and I just wanted to hop on and say that do what you love okay one of the main reasons why I am doing the um, pearl business is number one I love it I really do but number two it's because I want to be able to be here the whole time I I, I want to be able to be out with the horses out in the country um making a difference in kids' lives through equine therapy. Um, and then I want to be able to be at home more for my family. And that includes doing pearls. And I love being able to go live with my youngest daughter who is autistic and struggles with emotions um, with being able to communicate with people. And it's something that she absolutely loves are these pearl li these, these lives when we open oysters. And I just wanted to, these lives when we open oysters. And I just wanted to give you kind of that, that piece of me. I mean, you've seen me the past few days getting on lives and playing games and doing all that kind of stuff. And the point is, is that I'm just not on there just to get sales. I'm on there um, to help my youngest learn a business, something that she can do that doesn't require a college degree. Um, something that will help her communicate with people and even in the simplest game um, and taking a risk like she's not a risk taker at all she hates ta taking risks because she wants to be a perfectionist at all times and by taking what I do in the pro business and she can see that just because you might not win the game it doesn't mean you lose just because you don't win the six oysters, you still get three. You still had fun in the process. Um, but I had to take a moment for myself this morning because I was feeling down and I'm like, I just want this to be successful, not just, not just to make money. This is a life lesson for her and for me. Um, and it will allow me to be able to do equine therapy full time. Full time. And that has been a lifelong dream for me. Um, I grew up um, called Birchwood Farms up in uh, Door County, Wisconsin. And my grandma, every summer, she would open the business from May until September, and they would give trail rides, and they would have day campers come during the summer, and they would come either, we had morning day campers, afternoon day campers, or all day day campers, and they were kids that would come and learn how to brush horses, learn how to um, take care of horses, teamwork. Um, they learn how to ride. They learn those, those everyday life lessons, the, the challenges, the struggles, the wins. Um, you know, we had a horse show at the end of every summer. And so they got to use everything that they knew, learned 
all summer long in order to um, build confidence. And so when I say that I'm doing the pearl business, it's so much bigger than that, guys. So much bigger than that. I am currently a special ed teacher for middle school. And I pour everything that is in my soul into that job and working with those kids with special needs. And it's in my heart. But I also don't want to miss out on my own child. And both of my girls struggle with anxiety, depression, ADHD. Becca struggles with autism. And I want to be able to be around for them every day. I want to be around to love them and show them that you can do things that you're passionate about. So that's all. I just wanted to hop on and kind of give you a little bit more into me and not just sitting in front of my big castle trying to sell you something. Because what I'm trying to sell you right now is for you to have a happy life. If that is watching Pearl Girls shuck their oysters, do it. If that is going out horseback riding, do it. If that's swimming, running, jogging, traveling, do that now. Life is way too short. Way too short. So since I've had my horse fix and my little bit of a cry, my release, um, I'm going to head home, spend some time with my family, and then I'll probably hop on a little bit later today, uh, and shuck some oysters. Thank you for joining, and I love you all, and I look forward to getting to know each and every one of you, all right? Not just coming on to buy something. I want to hear from you. I want to know about you, all right? Talk to you later. Bye.